Black Sun 1942 asks, "What are your feelings about marijuana?" I have personally been a longtime proponent and advocate of marijuana use, and I've taken personal inspiration in my life from people like Carl Sagan, one of my heroes, who is a strong advocate of marijuana. If you choose not to make marijuana a part of your personal lifestyle, why not? Ask well, Black Sun. 1942, I do choose not to make marijuana a part of my lifestyle or alcohol of any kind or any kind of drug or any kind of mind altering apart from like Advil. I take Advil. And that's just my own personal thing. I, I've never done any kind of drugs. I've never even smoked a cigarette. And up until um, last year, I had never drunk alcohol and never been drunk before. And actually, I've only ever really been drunk once. So that's just my own sort of personal way about uh, of of going through life. Is I'm not I've never never been interested in marijuana use. When it comes to other people, you know the there's a few different things. You know, obviously, first of all, there's the issue of legality, and in, in that marijuana is currently not legal. Marijuana is illegal, so. That's the first barrier. But, you know, who really cares about that? I mean, we all do a lot of things that are illegal. Um, and ultimately, I mean, I know a lot of people who use marijuana, and it's fine for them. And, it, you know, they, they have a good time, and um, they get stoned. And, uh, you know, one thing for me is that, again, it all comes back to moderation. It's a matter of... Um, how much are you smoking and, and you know, are, are you dependent on it? Now, I know that marijuana isn't chemically dependent but at all, but I have known, uh, but just anecdotally, I've known tons of people in my life who have tried to quit, have tried to, like, stop using marijuana and have, like, had the desire to, like, I don't want to use marijuana anymore and haven't been able to. And I think it's addictive in, in other ways, not necessarily chemically, but as a as sort of a social thing as a you get addicted to anything and anything of the, the just too much of anything is not a good thing so but marijuana you know used sparingly and whatever sparingly means for the individual if that means you know daily or weekly or monthly or you know everybody has is going to have their own sense of how much is too much and how much is enough i think is fine you know i don't do it but i don't think it's wrong when other people do it necessarily you know I do have like friends who when they get stoned I kinda don't really want to be around them because they're just they get a little more I don't I can't like find that I can't hold like a real sort of deep conversation with them you know it's this conversation tends to stay on this like really level and we don't actually I never feel like I'm actually connecting to them as it's obvious that I don't I've never smoked pot or anything I'm gonna turn it over to Dan now Dan the cameraman and we're gonna turn it into a little bit of ask Dan because he can tell you a little bit more about smoking pot because he's actually done it um, and I haven't and my you know my views of it are just from watching other people do it and judging it that way which probably isn't a very good judge so here's Dan what's the question what do you think about marijuana oh I've had my fix with marijuana uh, but not really because still I like to get stoned but a it is definitely addictive and B um, it affects your short-term memory. <laughs> it affects your short-term memory, and it really does. And it makes you not really motivated. It makes you not motivated, lethargic. And, but this is all just, I mean, it's all different for other people, right? What are your positive experiences with marijuana? Well, sometimes it's really nice to just not have to care. Sometimes that's all you really want, is to just not care. And marijuana is really helpful in that way. 
Also, if you have AIDS or are going under chemotherapy, I would suggest smoking pot. I like to talk into the microphone like this. Alright, we're not going to use any of this, yeah. so...